You know, I think what, what sets both Vietnam and, and, and also ASEAN apart from, from the rest of the world is also its phenomenal investment in education. Um, it's not just recent, it's, it's, it's true and do, deep in the culture of the region to invest in education. And that has obviously been one of the fundamentals to help the region uh, spur forward. So that is certainly a message that we need to carry across. I do think that what we are seeing, unfortunately also in ASEAN, is that as that education has become more and more inclusive, as girls are now actually in many countries um, superseding boys in attaining high levels of education, um, the economies are still not taking full advantage of that really fantastic resource of well-educated young women in their workforce. We still have fairly low uh, workforce participation um, of women and our colleagues from McKinsey keeps reminding us of how much uh, waste that is. I mean, the, the, the GDPs of these, these economies could grow so much more by including women in the workforce. 